Good morning, Carrie. Good How morning. are you? I am well, thank you. How are you? I, I am fine, thank you. Good. I was driving and I thought, that's a cool minivan. <laughs> <laughs> and that is exactly what you said. Yes. <laughs> because we do have the same exact vehicle, yes. Dodge Grand Caravan, right? Yes. And what caught my attention, I am just giving the, the story here, is that you have some solar panels out here <laughs> four of them with a huge battery bank yes. a jaggery 1500 you said yes Perfect. and those those fold up and fit in right here next to my bed on this side of the van very nice and you have a, a cargo box yes and what do you have back here of my storage containers for my cooking utensils, my food items, um, my regular stuff, my toiletries and my laundry stuff, just miscellaneous things and white ex excess wipes and plastic bags, stuff that I don't access as often when I'm at I access more when I'm out in the desert somewhere, not more so much in the city. And you were telling me you do have some storage underneath, right? Yes, yeah, so I built a platform here to make this level and then I have a hatch because one of my seats is up, not stored in the floor, so I have more storage underneath here. Perfect. Can we take a look at the inside of your home? Yes. Let's go this way first. You were having your coffee. Yeah. Well, have it while it is still warm. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Even if I got you unprepared, I told you I think you are the cleanest, tidiest, <laughs> camper I have seen in a while. Well, that's nice to hear. Thank you. <laughs> You're very welcome. So, yes, you do have your seat up there. Yes. And you sleep with your head there. Yes. And you were telling me you prefer that? Yes. Mm -hmm. And I try to park somewhere where I can see both the sunrise and the sunset when I go to bed at night and look out the windows. So that's nice. One of the so nicest things about living out here is being able to see the sunrise and sunset, isn't it? Yeah, being in nature. And you have your fridge I here. Do. And this is a bodega. Yes. It's a big one. It is. I thought when I, I bought it before I bought my van, I thought I was going to have a bigger vehicle than this. But this was the size I that worked well for me. Perfect. And how is that fridge working for you? It works very well. I usually, I have a smaller Zachary as well. Okay. So, 240 and I can I can run the fridge off of this and I can keep this plugged into my van really? through the, the lighter plug to charge it nice that's usually what I do well the thing is I don't know much about this particular brand of fridge but I think you have to have very good insulation I mean the fridge has to have very good insulation Yes. So it doesn't use that much energy. Right. It used a lot more in the summertime. Of course. Yes. Mm -hmm. Not so much now. And I had this rug because I initially bought it put down here and it got dirty. So I figured I'd just use it on top to help with insulation on the top portion. That is a great idea. Thank you. Yes, indeed. Can we take a look at how you built your bed? Because that sure. is what absolutely impressed yes, me. Yes, maybe on the other side. Mm -hmm. I was initially going to build it out of wood and I found somebody had made one out of PVC pipe that I thought would be better for lightweight. Uh -huh. So I just built a frame and and this is this is not part of the bed, this is an extra piece. But I built the frame and then put plywood on top and this is actually attached with some strong Velcro. But I just have, Perfect. it's a six foot bed frame, six foot by two foot with a trifold mattress on top of it perfect and the floor uh, you were telling me that you put a board there yes to make it more level yeah I built I built that out and then put the cushions on top and I cut holes in these cushions to keep the bed from sliding all over genius you. and you store the solar panels here when yes, you have right to here. go yes it's perfect why does it look like bigger than mine <laughs> I don't know. It's funny how it how different vans look different, does isn't it? Right. Yes. Very nice. Thank and you. how long have you been on the road? I, I mean, started in July of last year. 
so July just, just over six months. 2022, so yes. six months. Yes. And uh, how are you liking it? It's it's very nice to be be able to be mobile and go wherever I want to go. Mm -hmm. uh, are you a full timer? At, at, mom at the moment, yes. Yes. And we are here outside of the RTR, so are you actually going to the... Yes, I'm planning to. I just arrived yesterday and this is my first time actually getting to, to visit the RTR. I've been planning this for two years and now I actually get to attend. Oh, I'm looking forward to it. That is amazing. Find a way of making some time to go and interact with people because you are going to make great friends. I was just saying that to myself before you mm -hmm. drove up and I said, oh look, there's another van just like mine. And yeah. so I'm looking forward to all the friends I'm going to be making today. Absolutely. Absolutely. So, thank you for being my first friend. <laughs> I am honored. Thank, thank you. you. Yes. And so you look so cozy there. <laughs> what are you making? I'm putting some cream cheese on my everything bagel. I'm going to have some cherry tomatoes. I usually also like to have a little salami slices, but I didn't get to the store in time to buy those before I headed out here. So it's just that and some fruit. Some that is a great recipe for nomads. I think I'm so. Yeah. And some watermelon. Nice. Great breakfast. Thank you. And you know what I forgot to ask you yesterday? Uh, about your bathroom accommodations. Oh. Sorry I mixed that with the food, but... Oh, no. It doesn't matter, does it? <laughs> if it goes in, yes, it will it have to, to come, come out, out yes. right? So yeah. I have oh, oh. down here my collapsible toilet stored underneath here. Ah. So... So you bag it. So yes. Perfect. Yes, and I use um, the poop bags for dogs. Nice, nice, perfect, and easy. So and then I suppose you use a bottle for pee. Yes. Yes. Right here. Perfect. Perfect. Yes. I forgot to ask you that, and people yeah. like to know how we do it. Yes, I know. I think I I had my toilet out yesterday because I hadn't put it away yet. But yeah. Thank yeah. you. You're welcome. So Thank you. So we were just talking about how people like to see how everyday things on videos and I know I appreciated all the videos I watched to prepare for this to see how I would do things and I was so prepared and I you know I had everything physically that I needed but I never could have prepared for what was going to happen up here when I started van life wow. and all the perspectives all the things I thought about as I saw other people living in their vehicles and then is everybody looking at me differently now I'm one of those people one of those people and I've been really learning over the last few years to love and um, appreciate myself and not judge myself and trying not to let other people's opinions of me affect me and that was a huge thing for me to learn experience feel and get over and I'm still I feel like I'm on the tail end of that yeah. but it was and there will be a lot. bad days and but you are you have the right uh, perspective the right approach attitude Thank to you. tackle nomad life yeah you're doing it great thank you, thank you. Yes. <laughs> and thank you Carrie and yes I will see you there perfect bring your chair we sit together and we talk and we criticize everybody else perfect <laughs> <laughs> I love that thank you so much Adriana thank you okay. see you later I've been low, I've been chasing all the things I never had before, all the way down by the river, I found a place where I can drown the old you, and when you look on the horizon, what you see is what you get.